Animal Homes. Written by Debbie Martin. Designed by Jane Rigby. Illustrated by Alan Baker. Dormouse's Nest. A bramble bush is a good place for a dormouse's nest. The nest is made of bark and leaves. The mother dormouse has made a soft grassy bed for her babies. The nest doesn't have a door. The dormouse pokes its way out with its nose. Dormice like to eat nuts and berries. This fat dormouse has just eaten some nuts. Look under the leaf to see the leftovers. Hmm. Ah, these nutshells are empty. See how the dormouse has nibbled a hole to get the nut out? Polar bears dig their dens in the snow. The den keeps them safe from the cold and wind. Whose bottom is this? Let's find out. Polar bear babies are called cubs. These cubs were born inside the den. The cubs are growing very fast. Oh, look, the den is getting too small for them. As the cub grows, the mother Digs some snow away to make more room. Look, she made it bigger. Polar bears don't get cold, even when it's snowing. They have woolly fur to keep them warm. Polar bears have thick fur underneath their paws. It is like a pair of warm slippers. Most birds build their nests high up in the trees. This keeps them safe from cats. The father bird has brought a wiggly worm for the mother bird to eat. The mother bird lays her eggs in the nest and she sits on them to keep them warm. Let's lift the flap to see how many eggs she has laid. Ooh. One. Two, three, four, five, six eggs. The nest is made from twigs. It is built in a bowl shape. This stops the eggs from rolling out. Let's see. Ah, look, there they are. The baby birds have hatched. They are very hungry. The mother and father feed them juicy grubs. Grubs is a kind of um, bug. Otters live near rivers. They often play in the water. Their thick fur keeps them warm and dry. Hmm. He's saying, can you find my friend? Ah, oh, let's see. Ah, there he is. This otter is swimming fast to catch fish. How many fish can you see? Well, let's see. Hmm. There's one, two. Look, he's after the big one. Three and four. Four. Yep, I only count four. Otters dig dens along riverbanks. Lift the flap to look in the den. Hmm. Ooh. Look, there's babies. The baby otters can't swim yet. The den has two entrances. Can you find them both? Well, here's one. She's coming up from the water. Ah, here's the other one coming in from the outside on the land. Rabbits dig their homes underground. 
The home is called a burrow. This rabbit wants to leave the burrow. It must look to see if it is safe. <gasps> she says, I smell a fox. Let's see. Does she smell a fox? <gasps> yes. This fox is hunting rabbits. Can you see a rabbit running away? Yep, there. See? The mother rabbit pulls soft fur off her chest. She puts it on the floor to keep her babies warm. Hmm, how many babies can you count? Let's see. There's one, two, three, four, five. Yep, there's five. Chimpanzees, or chimps, live in warm, damp forests in Africa. At night, they sleep in leafy nests in the trees. This chimp is about to wake up. Lift the flap to see why. Up! Oh. Young chimps play at building nests in the daytime, but they curl up in their mother's nests at night. I want to play. Chimps are good at climbing trees. Their long fingers and toes help them hold on to branches. These chimps are looking for fruit to eat. Can you find any? Let's see. Ooh, these are figs. Chimps love to eat them. Hamsters dig their homes in the ground. The home is called a burrow, just like the rabbit. Who is hiding behind the flowers? Hmm. Uh -oh. The snake might eat the hamster if it comes too close. Hamsters carry food back to their burrow inside their cheeks. Look behind this rock to see inside a hamster's burrow. See. Ooh. These hamster babies are a week old. They stay in the burrow with their mother. Oh, they have food that they put over in this area. Hamsters sleep during the day and come out at night. And that is the end.